So the Plus CE has a really cool feature. It's called a catalog help menu. So this uh, calculator is really a computer that has a bunch of programs. And so you can go to each individual program by hitting second catalog. Now, um, let's say I don't know how to enter in an argument. So earlier we did something with, all right, so let's do function integral, all right? So now this particular uh, program here um, allows me to integrate um, a function from a lo lower boundary to an upper boundary. So basically I can find a definite integral using this function and it's an approximation, but I don't remember how to enter it in. So the catalog help menu will show me how to enter in the arguments and the variables and all that. So once I have this uh, program selected in catalog, I simply hit the plus button. When I hit the plus button, it pulls up the catalog help menu and it tells me exactly how I need to enter stuff in. It says enter in the expression, then the variable that I'm integrating, then the lower boundary, and then the upper boundary, and then I can even tweak the tolerance because it uses an approximation. Um, I can tweak um, to some degree what tolerance I want. And it also tells me that this is numerical integration. And I could enter in, let's say I wanted to evaluate x squared right, from 1 to 2, and let's say that I want to approximate that with a delta x of point, oh, I got to put in the variable. So I got to remember that I'm, a, I'm integrating with respect to x, my lower boundary is going to be 1, my upper boundary is going to be 2, and then my tolerance, I'm going to put 0 0.00001. So I want a very precise approximation. And so now that I have all that information entered in, if I hit enter, it pulls it up this way. Okay, uh, this is in math print. Now obviously if I go back here and um, if I go to mode and I change it to classic print, um, I'd have to enter that in manually. So if I hit second, catalog, F, um, I come down to the function integral thing uh, and I would enter it in as x squared comma x comma 1 comma 2 comma 0 0.00001. I don't remember what I put in there. So now I'm not going to get that fancy math print, but it's the same thing. So if I hit enter, um, it, it tells me that the area under the curve 